So in this little game, I have to take this witty bitty sword and poke everything to death. But they don't like that, so they get pretty bitey. So now me poking them to death is justified. We could just do it one at a time, or we just find a good window of opportunity and just drag across the whole horde like that. And then once we take out all of them, we get upgrades. Like an orbiting cactus ball, some chain lightning, or toxic mushroom, dealing damage to any enemies within range. I do like the idea of lightning jumping between enemies, so we're gonna go there. And whoa, they're big already okay aha and the lightning's already kicking in that's very good okay and the big guys spawn little guys that's how slimes work doesn't ow it doesn't matter where you go and one of them already bit me that was rude sing, sing, sing. so i just gotta be careful about how quickly i slice at them because sometimes they'll catch me in their teeth but some of them drop hearts so all damage is fixed and then we move on with even better things Aha, some items, some max hearts, restore two hearts when picking up a heart, or revive with one heart on death. It's all about hearts this time, I guess. We'll go with two more max hearts. That sounds like a good idea. And the new weapon, or a chance to deal triple damage. Ooh, I like that idea. I wonder if that would connect with the chain lightning. Let's go ahead and get it. And then, ah, look at that, little goblins with slingshots. And I'm already dealing triple damage. That's very good. Just gotta, eh. Get rid of the range guys first, ideally. Ow! For exactly that reason. Just gotta be a little precise with it. And then I can not worry about preciseness anymore. Just gotta pop them all with pokes and lightning. It doesn't look like the lightning is affected by the triple damage, but that's okay. Because the lightning clears out everything. Oh look, a Mario star. Chance to drop a star to attack random enemies or a chance to create a saw blade and the cactus ball again. Let's get the shooting star and see how that does. Oh, are these beehives? I think they're beehives. Oh yes, and they are very angry bees. Just gotta get them out of here. Where's the star? Hello, star. Oh, <laughs> there it is. Oh, it's a little bop on the head. Oh, that's so cute. Come on, take out this one. Come on, star, take out this one, please. Please, I need to see this. There's also a right click that I can do where I just dodge, but that doesn't seem to be very useful. Speaking of not useful, the star has absolutely just taken a holiday, I guess. So we'll clean this up. Oh, magma leaves a fire trail that burns enemies or we can upgrade to lightning. Lightning bolts jump to more nearby enemies. Yes, please. And oh, little wizards. And wow, okay, they launch big flurries of attacks. Maybe that dodge is about to become a lot more useful. Let's go ahead and try it. Ah, yeah, okay. It doesn't last too long, so I gotta be careful with that. And just take out ranged enemies as quickly as possible. So I'm guessing the star chance is related to me striking enemies and not just standing by. We have shurikens that bounce between enemies. Chance for enemies to fire quills on death. I do like the attacks that bounce between enemies. We'll go with the shuriken. And wow, yep, there's a lot of them. Okay. But the shuriken is already bouncing between enemies, so that's a good thing. Just gotta find a good time to slowly drag the cursor over enemies. Ow! That was not it. Just so I can make sure I hit them instead of the sword just kind of phasing through them like whack. And I only hit one there. And my goodness, I'm getting hit quite a bit. I need to clear out these wizards. But he's protected by the big slimes. Thankfully, they work against him by bouncing shurikens like crazy. And... This becomes a very simple mission now. And we get hearts. That's always good. Ooh, a 32 combo. Hello. Pulls in nearby hearts towards you. Deals one more slash damage per missing heart. Interesting. Or longer invincibility after taking damage. We can get the magnet. That looks like a good idea. Okay, do I like any of these weapons? Fire, freezing, or toxic spores? I'm not sure I do. Let's go ahead and use a reroll. Oh, there's a the saw blades again. On a little ghosty. Chance for dead enemies to summon a ghost that attacks other enemies. I mean, yeah, I kind of want to. Oh, storm clouds. Well, that looks fun. What do they do? They zap things. I can zap things too. Provided they actually, there we go, zap. And these bees are just the most annoying things. Gotta get rid of the hives. There we go. And the little ghosts are doing the work too. Ooh, there's a gun. Chance to fire a laser that pierces through enemies. Hmm, I only have one more weapon slot. So let's just upgrade what I do have before I make any permanent decisions. Right now, the only permanent decision I have is to just delete everything. And that was a lot of ghosts right there. Amazing. 
Ah, oh, that saw blade. It's very I tempting, mean. but we'll upgrade the star again for dropping even more stars on enemies. Oh, there's sad mushrooms. Oh, it's so bad. But, uh oh, oh, okay. It seems like he just attacks on death. So we just got to be cautious of that. Sadly, they don't hit the other enemies. So I have to do all the work and the stars do the other half of the work. Stars falling from the sky is looking very nice indeed. Ow, that did not feel nice. Okay, just get rid of them all and get the heart towards me. I lost two hearts there. That was rude. And now we can get a higher chance to deal damage. We're at wave 10 now, so we're doing good. And it kind of shows by how many enemies are on the screen. Just gotta eh, be surgical with getting rid of the goblins and poke them. And then let them release the ghosties because the ghosties are the best thingies ever. And the combined might of shurikens and lightning is looking very powerful indeed. And the little goblin in the middle is doing a funny dance. <laughs> Look at him go. He's just happy to be here. He's like, woo, you can't hit me. Uh-oh, he stopped moving. That means I can hit him. Ah, yeah. See, what's nice is that the sword is entirely attached to the cursor, so I can stay very precise with this. And just sneak into the middle like a you, and then just pop like a balloon. And then pop you like a balloon. Ow, how'd that bite me? That was rude. Just release all the ghosties. Yes, chain reactions on all of them. And ugh, all the stars drop. Oh my gosh, that's so many stars. It's beautiful. Oh, and now we have a Voltor. Deals double damage briefly after taking damage. I actually only have half of my hearts left, I just realized. Deals damage to all enemies after taking damage or recover all the hearts. Hmm, yes. I can only get that once, but I feel like that time was worth it. Okay, all new weapons right here. I'll reroll once. If I get the saw blade again, I'll take it. I actually don't. Upgrade the lightning. Oh, look at that, they got mustaches. And they're still bitey. How can you be so bitey with a mustache? It's very improper of you, gentlemen. Just gotta teach you some manners and bring out some more big slimes so we can create more enemies, which means more chances for things to happen. And oh man, the falling stars is a beautiful sight indeed. But man, oh man, they are filling the screen. At least I can create a lot of ghosties very quickly. I just hope that none of these enemies get to the point where they deal two damage per hit because that would be very impolite. But man. Oh man, the stars falling from the sky is amazing. It's like that one guy from Elden Ring. And we are ranking up a 158 combo. That was beautiful. Okay, Sawblade again. Or oh, there's a missile. Reroll. Star. I like decisions being made for me. And the decision has been made for all of you that I just eliminate you as quickly as possible. Did I just kill a bee? I don't think that's how that works. But something happened there. It's just a loud popping sound is what happened. And bah, get rid of the hive. And circle again. Ha! Oh, I missed. Ow! And these guys did not miss, so that was a little bad. Oh, more triple damage. Or upgrade the shurikens, finally. Bounce more times? I think it's time I upgraded you, because everything else is level 2, except for the ghosts. I could use the more ghosts. And they did not need to get more mushrooms, I tell you that much. I might need to start dodging here, but I could just dodge by moving the mouse, and that works simply enough. And I can take out the medium-sized slimes pretty quickly now. I like it. And I can thankfully take out the new mushrooms just as quickly. So now that the biggest threats are off the table, it's just a very quick cleanup procedure with so many stars and ghosts. Oh, a bomb. They're Attach bombs. a bomb to an enemy. Oh. Let's re-roll. Oh, do I upgrade the lightning or the stars? The stars are doing very good. Let's upgrade the stars. I want to see more stars. Oh, ninja goblins. Just get rid of you. Whoa, okay. Oh, they move. Wow, they're getting fancy with it. But sadly, it's not helping them too much. I, I think I just killed one by it teleporting into me. That's kind of funny. And oh my gosh, so many stars. Okay, a heart potion, hourglass, or dice rolls. Oh, adds more rerolls. Let's go ahead and get a heart potion, and hopefully one of the enemies will drop one. The saw blade is taunting me. I only have one more reroll. Let's see what it gets. Lightning. And big guys to just generate a whole lot of ghosties for me. That's working very nicely. I wonder if there's going to be a boss wave. But so many lightning strikes and shurikens is working nicely for me. So if there was a boss, I don't think I'd have to worry too much. Ow! Unless that happens. But hey, they dropped a heart, and so I get double the hearts back thanks to that upgrade. So we're... Ah, and I lost it again. Yay! The moment I start to do good, something bad happens. Why does this always be like this? But now all the mustachios are gone, so it's a quick cleanup. And now we could get... Let's get the shuriken leveled up for more bounces. And these are just more normal goblins, but sadly there's a lot of them. Just gotta be surgical. Woo, but double heart drops there. That was very nice, and now I'm at full. See, that's why I don't like the upgrades that depend on not having health, because I like having health. 
It's a very healthy thing to do. Oh, now we can finally level up the ghosts. So they stay longer. Very good. Whoa, what are you? Like little hard hat things. Whoa, okay, lasers. Just get rid of the lasers. Just, no, no, no. No lasers for you. No lasers for you. I, ow. I have one more weapon slot, so I could get lasers for myself. But, oh man, they, okay, I can tell you guys are gonna be annoying very quickly. Thankfully, <laughs> the moment they're gone, it's a very quick operation. Okay, lightning. And oh, these are, okay, wow, they got twirly mace things. I'm not a fan of that. And I don't know if the ball is the only thing that hits me. Maybe I'll leave them alive as best as I can and then experiment with that. Just gotta take out enough of these other enemies without targeting them because they don't take a whole lot of damage from other things. Now I'll just get rid of you. Okay, they're alive. Now I'll we'll trim you down to one. Just need one of you alive. Okay, now you attack and I'll be very close to you. Okay, swirl, swirl. Oh, need to time that better. And swirl. Aha! So the ball is the only thing that hits me. I'm learning this. Woo! More heart drops. Or the snail reduces projectile speed. I need more hearts, I think. So we'll get the clover. Okay, now I can upgrade both level five things or get a saw blade. I kind of want the saw blade, finally. I've been holding off for too long. Now, whoa, dragons. I don't even know what you do. He looks like he just laughs. He's just like, ha ha ha. And I'm like, what's that? It seems like he's attacking faster the more times he does it. Or I'm just making that up. I'm probably making that up. I would like to make up seeing a, oh, there it is, saw blade. Woo, ah, I got distracted. But saw blade is looking, oh yes, I like it. And all the stars falling is beautiful. So now we can properly upgrade the saw blade to get higher chances of that. Oh, it's all mustachios. Oh, I feel bad for striking down such proper looking gentlemen. How can they do so wrong with mustaches as fine as these? At least the magnet's working very good. And it's just a flurry of things the moment I poke somebody. I love it. And there's so many little ghosties. I want more of them. And it's kind of sporadic how the enemies are dying with everything going on. I'm just working my way from left to right so I can be very thorough about this and not have to worry about getting bit. But man, oh man, there's so many of them that pop out of those guys. Ow, and sometimes they pop into me and then bite me right away. That's rude. But they should have a higher chance of dropping a heart. So I should be able to heal up by the end of this level given how many enemies there are. At least, ideally. Ow, that doesn't seem to be the case. But we'll get more ghosties. And then, okay, wait for the enemies to populate and then take out the danger ones right away. Okay, lasers, ow. What did I get hit by? I don't know, but there's a heart right there. So I heal up a good amount there. Drop a lot of stars right there. Ow, morning stars are ouchies. And just a quick cleanup like so. Very nice. Aw, little ghosty didn't have anything to do. Well, we'll upgrade the saw blades again. I like seeing more of these. Yes, two of them. Aha, and a heart there. Awful. Oh, this is a new item. Ghost sheet. Enemies take longer to attack you. Oh, that could be handy. Or reduces max health for all enemies. Hmm. I'm not really having a hard time with killing them in a good amount of time, so we'll wait for them to attack longer and then get even more ghosties. You got ghosties with the ghosties. Now attack them all at once. Okay, we took out half of them, I think. That's good. That's ow, freaking very good. But man, they suddenly attack very quickly. So more saw blades. And okay, do not leave the cursor in the middle of the screen. That was a bad idea. Thankfully, I didn't get hit by anything though. And I just need to poke something once for all the mayhem to begin. Just a little poop and then run away. Just a little poop, poop and run away. Oh, whoa, dragon. Get out of here, dragon. It's fun seeing the ghosties right on top of the saw blades like they sometimes do. He's just going on a cruise, but look at how many spawn as well. I like these higher chances. I don't even know if they're higher chances. They're just good chances. Speaking of good chances, I would like a good chance at a heart, please. But we can't have everything, I guess. So instead, we get more stars because that seems to be doing the most damage. And whoa, yep, that's a lot. Get rid of the robots. Eh, very good. Whoa, dance through the morning star. That worked pretty good. I like how I called it a mace to begin with, and now I'm just calling it a morning star. It's about time I got more chance to deal triple damage and then just attack everything as quickly as possible before it gets wise. And whoa, whoa. <laughs> if you want a lot of things to happen, just poke one of the mustachios. So all these look new, except for you. Deals one more slash for every 10 combo you have, or when you complete a wave, but stack is lost on taking damage. 
I'm taking damage fairly often. I don't think this is going to help me. I do build up quite big combos, though. So let's take the boxing gloves. And I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure the shooting stars feed into the combo as well. So it'd be good to upgrade that more. And okay. They, yeah, they do. They do. Aha, I knew it. At least... As far as when the enemies get actually eliminated, but look at how many ghosts there are. It's too bad Halloween already happened. Ah, so now we are at max level shooting stars. That's a good situation to be in. Oh my gosh, there's so many of them. Get back here, ninja. Ah, I took a hit to get rid of you. <laughs> I love the little ghost army. I need more of you. <laughs> and get rid of everybody. Yes. Wow, we. Okay, taking quite a bit of damage, but there's also quite a bit of hearts that are finally dropping. And more ghosties. I need all the ghosties on the field. And also get rid of everybody before they attack twice. So now we're at wave 30, or that was wave 30. An alarm clock? Deals double damage briefly at the start? I think yes. And, oh. <laughs> I was so ready for enemies to start spawning. I started swinging. More ghosties. And just deal the damage all around. Wow. I think that just got rid of Mustachio's instantly very nice max level ghosties good problem to have it's not even a problem but they're having a problem because they're all out of friends okay now we're almost to max level lightning so let's go ahead and work on that and oh yeah saw blades are helping as well and the ghosties are staying for so long i'm proud of them that means more of them get built up on the screen with their dumb little faces more saw blades i think let's just coat the screen in saw blades because why not we're already coating the screen in stars and ghosts let's just Add to the mix. Ow. And both of you need to stop hitting me like that. What are you? A bubble shield. Become invincible briefly every 10 seconds? The waves aren't even lasting that long anymore. I could use some more rerolls. Let's go ahead and do that. Not that I'm going to use them, though. Max level lightning. And not quite, because I was only level 7. So let's just clean out all these enemies. That's so many saw blades. And then we can get a max level lightning. So the lightning just jumps between effectively everybody. Ow. And thankfully enough hearts drop that even though with all the damage I'm taking, I get filled up pretty fast. So what are we gonna have once the weapons are all upgraded? Well, let's get to Sawblade level six and then figure that out when we get there. If we get there, we're taking quite a bit of damage here. Ow, but thankfully hearts are frequent. And oh, look at that three hearts on the screen at once. Amazing. That clover is doing some work. And there's a shield as well. Spawns an orbiting shield that blocks projectiles. Ooh, I think yes. Look at that, I got a little shield friend and he looks just like me, except he's a shield. Okay, max level saw blades, here we go. All day, every day, ow. I'm not sure what would be more effective, moving the shield into the projectiles or just holding still. I can't hold still. I need to keep slashing with increased triple damage chances. I don't even notice if there's any new enemies on the screen. They're all just kind of expiring so fast. We are also at wave 40, so that's something of note. And now both of these weapons are so low level, so we're gonna be seeing that screen fairly often. Oh my gosh, there's so many projectiles on the screen. <laughs> and thankfully, some of those projectiles are hearts, even though that's not really what hearts classify as. But they help me, so I'll call them whatever I want to. And just <laughs> heart in the middle of the entire field of enemies. That's not helping me anytime soon. Except it kind of is, because I'm passing over the middle of the screen fairly often. Look at how many small slimes there are, and look at how many ghosties! I would not be this excited about the ghosts if they had any other face. That is the best face ever. And I'm dealing 60 damage quite a bit because of the double damage at the start, and then triple damage from the higher chances. And now we are at max level triple damage. So we should see... Yeah, enemies disappearing very quickly. I just wish everything else benefited from double damage or triple damage, I mean. They kind of are? How am I dealing 36 damage? Oh yeah, the combo. And now the only thing left to upgrade is a shuriken. That's no biggie. Whoa, whoa, okay, it's a little biggie. Ow, I'm, I'm very hurt. I am very hurt. I need a heart, please. Ah, ow, no! <laughs> Finally got taken down, but we got to wave 45 and we have 966 little gems, which means that with all the other attempts I did on my own, we couldn't unlock a sword. Hmm, which one do we want? This one only costs 500 and the rest cost a thousand. Let's buy the one at the end because he seems interesting. Oh, <laughs> a bomb blade. Creates an explosion that deals damage to nearby enemies 
And yourself? Interesting. Well, you guys will have to let me know if you want to see that. So hope you guys enjoyed this video of Cursor Blade. Thank you very much for watching and sub to intern. I'd also like to thank the channel members, including Bread, Mr. Cripple One, Ancient Elixir One, Corby Farm, Dakota C, Donamoto, Devion X, Muffin Suffer, Lucas S, Splatter Sax, The Real Nickname, Edward, Hateful Harold, Peggy Sue, Drupalong, TJ, Seriously Sarcastic, Angel, and Lily Bites.